Huaneng Power International, HPI, has completed the world's largest floating solar project in Deju, which is in Shandong, an eastern Chinese province on the Yellow Sea. The 320 megawatt project is the largest floating solar farm to come online to date. Welcome back to Genesis. We're back today with another exciting episode on the topic, the world's largest floating solar farm. Before we proceed, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click on the notification bell for regular updates. A recent innovation is floating solar farms, which are positioned in reservoirs and lakes. This strategy is especially helpful in places with a shortage of green space and high land prices. A 100 megawatt wind farm and 8 megawatt hour of battery storage are linked to the Deju Dingzhuan floating solar farm, which is situated next to a 2.65 GW HPI coal-fired power station in Jingsu province's north central region. The Huaneng Deju Dingzhuan Integrated Wind and Solar Energy Storage Project is made up of all three. They all use the same electrical infrastructure to supply electricity to the grid. The 320 megawatt project is the largest floating solar farm to come online to date and covers an area of about two miles. HPI said it was able to install the 320 megawatt facility at about half of the cost of a conventional land-based project. It will provide electricity to the Beijing-Shanghai High-Speed Railway for 25 years after its commissioning. The solar panels cover an area of 21.6 square kilometers and it takes up to 15 minutes for a plane or helicopter to fly over the entire project site, so it's massive, isn't it? Huaneng's massive floating solar farm was constructed by SunGrow Power Supply, a Chinese PV inverter and project developer. The park consists of 170,000 solar panels installed on a reservoir in Deju and will produce enough electricity to power about 100,000 homes. HPI built a solar farm that serves as the world's largest floating solar facility in two phases, with capacities of 200 megawatt and 120 megawatt, respectively. The first phase was completed in 2020, while the second stage was completed between mid-September and the end of December. The plant is expected to generate around 550 million kilowatt hour of energy per year, HPI said, without further details on technical specifications. And that's not all. China might have the world's largest floating solar farm right now, but it won't hold that title for long. India is putting together a 1 gigawatt floating solar farm of its own and hopes to have it running by 2023. India's first floating solar farm is set to come online in 2023. The 600 megawatt project will be the world's largest upon completion and will set a new standard for renewable energy production. But as of now, China tops the list. China's largest floating solar farm has seen its capacity increased, putting it in the lead as the world's largest at 32 megawatts. According to CGTN, the site has been expanded by 100 more megawatt hours of power generation thanks to an additional engineering unit that was installed this week. China has pledged to limit its use of coal and emissions, and this is a significant step in that direction. It should be praised whenever a sizable renewable energy source goes online, especially in China. According to the Chinese government, the country won't start cutting back on coal use until around 2025. In September, Chinese President Xi Jinping said that his country would stop constructing coal-fired power projects abroad. That's fantastic. China, which is already responsible for a whopping half of global coal-fired power generation, is still launching new coal plants domestically to meet its enormous power demand. But almost all of China's newest coal plants are running at a loss and losing money for their owners. According to a report this month from researchers at China's State Grid Corporation, the nation is projected to add up to 150 gigawatts of new coal-fired power capacity between 2021 and 2025, bringing the total to 1,230 gigawatts due to worries about energy security. So that the tide turns and renewables can provide China with the energy it needs, let's hope China continues to implement even more significant green projects like this floating solar farm, because the introduction of new coal through 2025 is concerning. Will this be a change in the environmental impact? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe, and we'll see you again soon.